BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football. This is John Bennett at BBC Global Sport. The Everton midfielder Gilfie Sigurdsson was on the score sheet as Iceland qualified for the World Cup for the first time in their history. They beat Kosovo 2-0 at home to secure top spot in Group I. They're the smallest nation to have reached the World Cup. Former Premier League defender Herman Hreidersson says Sigurdsson has been the key to Iceland's campaign. We are terrific at set pieces and so we always believe we will score. We've got a great set piece taker there. He has been the main figure. He's got an absolute want of a right foot. So gives a lot of confidence through, throughout the team because we know we can defend. West Bromwich Albion forward James McLean scored the winner for Ireland in their 1-0 win over Wales in Cardiff. The result means Ireland are into the World Cup playoffs. Wales are out. Former Ireland midfielder Andy Townsend, who also played in the Premier League, says McLean deserved his moment. I said at the start of the evening that chances would be at a premium. It was actually even less than that. There was virtually hardly any chances. But one, one good opportunity for Ireland and James McLean, who's been... Certainly one of Ireland's strongest players in this qualifying campaign, to his credit, produced a magnificent goal worthy of winning any any game. Away from the World Cup, the Tottenham striker Harry Kane has been named on the 30-man shortlist for the 2017 Ballon d'Or award given to the world's best player. The referee blows his whistle. Harry Kane waits, runs up, right-footed and goes in off the post. Harry Kane, England's captain, and very much England's man of the moment gives England the lead from the penalty spot. Kane is one of seven Premier League stars on the 30-man list. Also included Liverpool's Sadio Mane, Chelsea's N'Golo Kante and Manchester City's Kevin De Bruyne. And for more football news from the BBC, go to bbc.com forward slash football. BBC Premier League update from the home of Premier League football.